Uh, we can't stand being locked inside the jail for crashing GoTube's 15th birthday party. Yeah I know right Chris. We always get arrested for invalid reasons and we couldn't find a way to escape and hide from those naughty police officers. Yeah, those police officers always stop us from causing trouble. Let me think of something so we can escape from jail at once. have a plan, right? I don't know what it is, but I like that looking in your eye. I know a way to escape from jail, and I know exactly what are we going to do today. We are going to dig a hole onto the floor and then we escape from jail, and then, we'll burn the forest near my brother Gorus' house, and even his house. Ooh, I love the idea, but the- By myself with my super strength. Stand back Bob, I'm starting digging the hole to escape from jail. There, the hole is done. Now let's jump into the hole to escape before the cops catch us. Bob, you go first. Jump. We e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e e and oh, I think they dug a deep hole to escape from jail. These criminals won't get away from this. Yes, finally, we escaped from jail. Now it's time to burn the forest including my brother Gorus house. Wahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahah
police, it's me Boris, my wife and they found out who set it up these trees in our house on fire. It was Chorus and Bob. What? OMG. Don't worry Boris, we'll stop them so they can't get away from it in front of us. We will arrest them once again. Thanks for letting us know. You are welcome officers, bye. Ha ha ha, nothing can stop us. Holy moly, we're so caught and busted. Do you really think you can get away from setting the trees in Gore's house on fire and from us? No. You are so caught red-handed big time. And we cannot believe you two dig the hole in the prison to escape. For this, you two are going to jail for a very long time this time. Get in the police car right now. Alright, you both are going to stay in jail for 10 months. And if you both dare to escape again, we'll execute you at once. Now stay in here forever. Josh, we are so screwed big time Bob. Now we can't escape again because they already put cameras everywhere. Yeah I know right Chris. We'll be old if we stay in here for 10 months. Can our lives get any worse from this? Man. This day is going to be the worst. Why? Because today is Victoria and Amid and Super Yellow Aryan 507's birthdays. And they are inviting their friends to come to their day party. I detest Victoria so much because she makes unfunny videos out of me non-stop. Which makes me feel more depressed and fed up. So the question is. What should I do with her and Amp, Aryan? I know exactly what I am going to do today. I am so going to crash Victoria and Amid and Super Yellow Aryan 507's birthday so bad, so I can make my best day ever. MWA ha 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 ha. But first, I'm going to get a hammer from the garage. I'm in. Now where's that toolbox where it includes all tools especially the hammer? Aha. Uh -huh. There it is. Where is that? Aha. Uh -huh. The hammer. I got it. Now that I got the hammer, it's time to ruin Victoria and Amid and Super Yellow Aryan 507's birthday party at once. MWA ha 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 Oof. Man. That was a lot of running. But at least I made it to her house where she and Arian celebrate their birthday with their friends. But before I crash and ruin their birthday, I'm gonna disguise myself as an old lady so I can trick them all. Alright. Now I'm disguised as an old lady, it's time to trick Victoria and Arian's friends before I crash their birthday. I'm almost there, I'm so gonna beat you at the finish line. Oh no you don't, my car is more faster than you. Oh yeah, do you really think that your car is faster? We'll see about that, I'm gonna use full speed power to get to the finish line first. Hell yes, I win, in your face sponge. God damn it. K5. I really want to thank all of you for coming to my and Super Yellow Year and 507's birthday party. Yeah. I agree with Victoria. We're having so much fun in here. Anytime Victoria and Arion. Oh? That must be Lemonade Shake. I'm going to open the door so he can come inside and join this amazing birthday party. My lord, old lady, what's the matter? What's wrong? May I help you with something? Actually, yes, you gotta help me, because, well, somebody took my purse. Oh no, why would somebody take your purse and steal your credit card? Okay, I'm going to help you, old lady. Glad you're gonna help me, and may I something to say to you before you met that person who took my purse. It's very important. And what is it? 
side. In your face. You've been tricked. Holy shabbily. It's Fat Lily. Why would you trick me like this? It's not funny. And why read you here, White House? You're not invited to my and Super Yellow Ear and 507's birthday party. Well, I'll tell you why one because it was my right to do it and two. I'm here to crash your and Super Yellow Area and 507's birthday party. Hey! You can crash my and Super Yellow Ear and 507's birthday party. I spent a lot of time setting it up. Now get out from here before I call the cops and your father. What? Are you trying to call the cops and my father to get me? All right. Since you attempted to do it, I'm so gonna crash her and Arian's stupid birthday party right now. Victoria and Arian and their friends. You all deserve to get your birthday crashed for having shady Yahoo channels with cringe content, so take that your bags in your faces. That Lily looks up you did. You crashed my and super yellow ear and 507's birthday party and my whole house was wet. Now thanks to you. Our party is ruined and there's no place to celebrate it now. You know what? We're so going to beat your ass up as revenge. That fatty girl is so gonna be dead when he lands into the garbage bags. Yes, you're right, Rain. And I'm so gonna call her father about the crap she is doing to my and super yellow ear and 507's birthday party. Even my whole house? Ow. My hips. My neck. How dare you? How dare you? Defy the most fatty and invincible. Lee. <laughs> Fat Lily, get your fatty ass inside the car right now. When we get back, you'll be in big trouble. Victoria Animate and Super Yellow Area and 507's birthday party. And also, how dare you at Victoria Animate's house? Now thanks to you, they have no place to celebrate it. That is it. You big fatty lady crossed the line this time, so this means we are punishing you forever and ever, with new stuff you like. And guess what today is? Today is your first punishment day. First punishment. We will summon T-Bone Animate to do an epic on you. T-Bone Animate, poop on her. <coughs> Thanks T-Bone. Ooh, gross. It's so disgusting. Shut up you big fat meanie. Second punishment, forcing you to get distracted. Rick rolled and crash and Bernstein on TV for 15 minutes.
Oh no, not this shit again. Why? OMG. That was awful. Who cares? Third punishment, wearing nappies. OWCH that hair did real bad. Shut the hell up fatty, for God's sakes. Fourth punishment, we will send you to the WGBH and BND of Doom logos. That's super goddamn scary. We don't care. Let's continue with your punishment day outside. Fifth punishment, flattening you. Ha 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 Do you have a machine that flattens me? Looks like you don't have one. Unlucky you. Unlucky me? Do you really think that I'm unlucky? You'll see about that. And last, but not least, sixth punishment, boring you. Yes, I finally buried Fat Lily. Now I won't have to deal with that fatty girl ever again. She is worse than my daughter Lily. Uh, Jesus! I really can't handle being stay inside in jail all day. There is nothing we can do now, because we are locked. I know Bob, they have put cameras everywhere to catch and stop the bandits from escaping from Gowl. I wish there was something we can do to escape without getting caught. You just gave me another great idea. We're going to escape from jail once again, but this time, we're using the Ion logic to escape. That sounds too epic the idea. Bob, let's do this together. The Ion logic. The Ion logic. Get this out from this jail now. The Ion logic. The Ion logic. Get this out from this jail now. We did it Bob, we finally escaped from Gao by using Vian logic. Now the question is, what should we do today? Um, I have no idea. But hey, how about we throw a clandestine party in a disco place? Sounds brilliant, let's do this. There we are, the disco club. I bet there's no one inside and there's everything set it up. Let's go inside. Look all of this, this place has lots of wine and beer. You know what Bob, we are going to make a great party in here with lots of people. Yeah right Chris. Wait, is there a party inside the club? Oh boy, I'm gonna dance inside. 
and all. Are they hosting a party inside the club? Me e e e e e e e I'm gonna go inside and dance. Hey look! There's a party inside the club. I bet they have beer and wine there. Yeah, and there's some people dancing in there. Let's go inside. Oh boy, me and Joey love to go to parties. Oh, wow, Elmo loves parties. Elmo wants to dance. Thank you so much guys for coming to my and Bob's first ever clandestine party. Now what do you all say we start the party? Yes, let's yeah, all dance. Yeah, you said a chorus. Alrighty dukies, let's dance. Not again. Where did these two criminals go? I bet they used to be in Blodger to escape from jail. And wait a second, I hear something. Nice dance moves, dude. Keep it up. Oh. I think Carice and Bob are throwing a clandestine party during the quarantine. These brats won't get away with this. They should know that throwing a clandestine party during the quarantine is illegal. And now they'll face the consequences once I catch them. Stop right there. You are all busted. You all break the rule number 348. Not throwing or hosting clandestine parties during the quarantine. That's it. Everyone go back home before we arrest you. And as for you, Chris and Bob, you are both going to jail again, but this time, alone in your jails. Alright. You are going to stay in jail. Until you get old. Man. This sucks. Now I got locked up in jail again alone without Chris. And Chris and I will stay in jail until we get old. Could mine and Bob's lives get any worse from this? Um, I wonder what's falling from the sky? Uh, what is this? Holy Jesus, it's an LG logo. Well, I guess this is a better logo than the BNDs. Huh? What's going on with the logo? Holy moly, it turned into a Pac Man. Wait, no, don't even think about eat me, I swear. Oh Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. <laughs> Fine, I guess you are my little pog champ. Come here. Ugh. Why are you telling me that I am your pog champ? I am not your pog champ, so take that. Ding dong! Man. I don't know what I dreamed. Oh well. Anyway, today is a beautiful day to go outside. Da 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 a a a. Saitama is back in action to stop baddies and troublemakers and save the day. <laughs> well, well, well. It's the two troublemaking guys Bob and Corey's. Why are you doing here in my sight? Aren't you supposed to be in jail? Yes, but we finally escaped once again by using steroids. The police won't stop and catch us. So, oh, oh, oh. And we promised ourselves to not cause any trouble in here. Oh, oh yeah, Bob is right. We promised ourselves not to cause any chaos in the city. We are trying to become good this time. Um. Okay. But don't even think about cause mayhem and don't even think about kidnapping someone. Remember that I have a great hearing. Okay, Saitama. 
We're now leaving. We are gonna eat lots of chicken strips at KFC. Ugh. Why these brats always annoy the heck out of me. They seriously have to cut it out. Alright, I'm going to sit on the bench and take some air in the park. Hello? You have reached Mayor Humdinger's phone number. Who is this and what do you want? Hello Mayor Humdinger, it's me Chorus. Oh hey there Chorus. What do you want from me? Listen, my brother Chorus and his wife Loris both threaded their kids so insane badly by beating them up, and worse, they contacted Kenny Anime to bring them all. I feel terrible for those kids who got abused by their parents, so I need you to help me and Bob to kidnap Goris and Loris and locking them up in my secret lair. They did what? Okay. I'm gonna help you kidnap them so you can lock them in your basement from your secret lair. Okie dokie, and can you please bring Speed O Sound Sonic, Harold Humdinger, Stefan and a few others to come over Goris's house, Bob and I will head to Goris's house right now. And you guys have to wait us there, got it? Got it. So see you there. Mayor Humdinger will bring some of our friends to come over to my brother's house. Let's go there right now. We are finally made at the his house. Now let's wait for the others to come over here. Thank you all for coming here. Now let's kidnap those morons at once, FBI style. Ah. This yoghurt tastes so good. And isn't great that we have to live in here without our psycho kid, sweetie? Um. Yes it is. Sweetie. We're having a great time inside the house without our children. <laughs> Oh. My. Goodness. Ha 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 We got you tied onto the wall. There's no way you can both escape and get help. Why would you all did this shit to us? That's not good kidnapping someone and tie them onto the wall. Yeah, my husband is right. You better all untie us or else we will call the cops on you. Who the hell cares? Go ahead and call him. We will beat their asses up if they try to stop and arrest all of us. And that's what you both get for threatening your kids so insane badly. Tie them into your creepy tree of them and hiring any animate to bury them all. If you both say another word to us, we will take you to the torture table to cut you in half. What you're all planning is pure cruelty. You are not getting away with this. So, Saitama, what are you gonna wish for Christmas? I don't even know. But I'll think about something to get for this Christmas. Help. Help, help, help. We've been kidnapped. Do you hear some people yelling for help? Yeah. And wait a minute, I recognize those voices. They are Goris and Loris, and they are yelling for help. I knew Coris and Bob would actually do something to Goris and Loris. I knew this was gonna happen. I'm so gonna stop them and his pals at once. Can I come with you? I want to beat those weirdos a hurtful lesson. Sure, 
Genos. You are welcome for helping me to stop Corey's and Bob's pals from kidnapping Goris and Loris. Let's go, before something cruel happens to them. 15 minutes later. We are gonna tell you one more time, release and get us out of here before we call the cops. Ha, never in a million years. Let go of Goris and Loris, villains. Or face my 280 fist punches to destroy all of you. PFFFT, destroying us with your 280 punches? Alrighty. I guess we have to do this the hard way. Holy shit. Oh shoot. Impressive. And you destroyed our entire gang. That's right. You are both alones, with no friends to defend you from me and Saitama. I agree, Genos. And for that, we will summon the cops to arrest you. And Corys, you are getting executed forever. Cops. Get these criminals arrested. Now. Bob, you are going back to jail permanently for kidnapping Goris and Loris along with Karis and his crew. And as for you Karis, when we get to the police station, you are getting executed, but this time, forever. Now get your asses inside the police car right now. You both have gone way too far this time. Oh shocks. Wow Saitama and Genos, we're deeply surprised and amazed that you both stopped and defeated Koris and Bob and their pals. Now can you release and untie us? I am on it. Thank you so much Saitama. You are really a great hero. Now what do you say we do the victory dance in our house by eating a pepperoni pizza from Papa John's? Sounds great honey. I agree. Me too. Alright, your friend Karis is now executed, so you won't be able to see him and cause more chaos in the in city ever again. Anyway, you are gonna stay in jail for 40 years. Why? 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 Why my friend Chorus got executed? He is one of my best friends. I will miss him so bad when... Hey! Bob! Stop acting like a child in the circus clown and shut up for God's sakes! Yum! This pepperoni pizza is divine. I like how they with delicious pizza sauce. Yep, exactly Saitama. It tastes so good. OMG. I love how Johnny Beach is riding on the wheelchair. L.I.M.A.O. Sorry, I didn't see you there. Yo guys, it's me, Millie. I'm Lily's last twin sister. It is nice to meet you all in the first place. And I just wanna say that a little bird told me that Goris kids Daisy, Cody, Emily, my twin sister Lily, Hannah, Sapphire, Agnes and Aminita caused a chaos in Thanksgiving during the dinner, and they got threatened so insane badly by giving them brutal punishments and get buried alive by Goris and Kenny Animate. Well, I was first created by Kenny Animate, and everyone is liking me more than my awful twin sister Lily. So oh oh oh. I am going to live in Goris' house forever, and I want to meet Goris and Loris for the first time ever in my life, because, well, um, Goris is such a nice man and he is respectful with everyone else. So, without further any delays, let's go to Goris' house. Come on. There it is. This is the house where Goris and his wife lives. I'm going over there to see his house. Indy. We-
Nadio, on the mission. Ugh. Why Indigo isn't helping the rangers? She is supposed to help them with the prairie dogs. Um. I wonder who they could be. Oh, hi, little girl. Who are you? What's your name? Oh, hi, Goris. I am Millie, Lily's twin sister. Oh, hi, Millie. It is so nice to meet you. And you look so oh, 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 cutier than my crappy daughter Lily and her siblings. Well, I really had it with those pieces of crap for crashing the dinner during Thanksgiving. So they are now buried alive and they'll never come back to life. Anyway, do you want to meet my wife, Loris? Well, yes. Alrighty. Sweetie, sweetie. Come over here. There's a new girl at the door. What is it? Sweetheart. Did you say, a girl at the door? Yes. And that girl is Millie. Say hello to her. Hey there Millie. I'm Loris, Gore's wife. It's an honor to meet you. You too Loris, and just to let you know that I'm Lily's twin sister. And I am here to stay with you, because you are gently and kind towards other people except your kids. May I pretty 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 please stay in your house for life? I'll be a nicer daughter than your crappy Lily. Well, since you are going to replace our siblings with you and become a nicer girl in here, you are staying. Permanently. Yeah, and this means... You are adopted and accepted in my house forever welcome to my house come in oh thank you thank you thank you thank you so freaking much for adopting me it is so nice to have you as my new parents it's a pleasure millie oh and by the way we want to show you your new bedroom really yes millie of course we do have a brand new bedroom for you follow us This is Lily and Emily's bedroom. Well, even though they are dead buried underground, and this will be your new room from now on. It's all. Yours. Enjoy your new room, new daughter. Thanks a lot, new mommy and new daddy. Well guys, this is going to be my very first day with Goris and Loris, and I'm glad that they adopted me as their new daughter. This will be my best day ever. E -e 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 -et. La 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 Oh yes. I finally created my YouTube channel. Now I'm gonna make my very first video for my YouTube channel. Hey dear Millie. Come downstairs. I've prepared a game for you. You are gonna love it. Um, what kind of game, Daddy? You'll see what kind of game is, once you come downstairs. I wonder what kind of game is. Okay. The game I prepared for you is... Find the hidden character. And guess who came here? Um, let me guess. Cyan's World Cartoon? You bet ya. Yeah. Cyan's World Cartoon. He came here to hide so you can find him. And to those who are watching this video, please don't read the comments, because it's cheating. Thank you. Anyways, let's start the game. Millie, you have two minutes to find that Viner Cyan's World cartoon. Because if you don't find him and if you lose the chance to find him, you won't have any rewards. Start finding him in 3, 2, 1, go. I wonder where did Cyan hide? Well, this place is cold, so Cyan isn't here in my parents' bedroom. I'll keep looking and finding him around the house. God damn it, Cyan isn't here in the dining room. I'm not giving up on finding him. Haha, uh -huh. 
Millie won't find me this time. You're close to find him. Keep going. It's warm warm warm. Hey, I know where did he hide. I see his hair. Found you. Oh you found me. Looks like I'm not good at hiding. But next time, I'll hide in a place where you can't find me. But good job for finding me. Millie sweetie good job for finding the hidden vinder. Cyan's world cartoon. You are good at finding people in hiding places. You are getting an ice cream sundae for reward. Well that game was fun, right Millie? Yeah right, you said it Cyan. Before we actually end this video, I wanna give a shout out to Cyan's World Cartoon for sending me his custom asset of his Christmas avatar on Discord. Subscribe to him today. Did you find me in the video? Let Vittorio know in the comments below. Man, I am still a single girl, with no boyfriend. I looked for a boyfriend in my school, and it looks like nobody wants to be with me. They are already taken by their girlfriends. And I am the only girl without a boyfriend. I wonder who could be my boyfriend. Hey, I know someone who can be my boyfriend. Kalu. But wait, Kalu doesn't even have a girlfriend in the show. Well. I don't care for that fact. So I am gonna make a video announcing to my fans that my new boyfriend will be Kalu. But first, I'm gonna get the camera from the living room. Alright, I got the camera. It's gonna start recording in 3, 2, 1. Hey guys, Gina here, and I have some excited news to all of you. Want to hear? I got a new boyfriend from my school. And guess who is that classmate of mine? Yes, it's Kalu. He is now my new boyfriend. And if you want to ship with me and Kalu as a couple, type in the comments. Hash Kajina. Anyways, this is me. Peace out. Bye. Done. The video is recorded. Now I'm gonna upload this video to my YouTube channel. I got my laptop. Now it's time to upload this video to YouTube, so my friends and fans can ship this couple and hashtag everywhere. Yes, the video is uploaded to YouTube. Now let's see if some of my friends like this video. Alright, let's see what's new on YouTube. Oh, uh, what is this? Oh my gosh, Gina just made a video having me as her boyfriend, and she put in the description, Hashkai Gina. She was supposed to realize that I don't have a girlfriend in my actual show, but no, she did this shit without knowing that I don't have a girlfriend. Ugh, looks like I don't have choice, but to report this to her mother will be a great idea. I'm gonna call her mother right now. Hello. You have reached Mrs. DeGaldo's phone number. Who is this and what do you want? Hello Mrs. DeGaldo, it's me K.I.U. Did you know what your daughter Gina did? She just made a video showing to her fans that she has me as her boyfriend. When I am actually not his girlfriend, she only uploaded this shit without knowing the fact that I don't have a girlfriend in my actual show. Can you please talk with her about what she has done? She did what? Oh God. Don't worry Kalo. I will have a serious talk with her about what she uploaded. Thanks for telling me. You are welcome Mrs. DeGaldo. Bye. And now that I reported this to her mother, I'm gonna post a criticizing comment to her and know the fact that I don't have a girlfriend in the show. Oh wow, my video just reached 1k views in 10 minutes, and it has 23 likes. But wait, there's one dislike. Well, it doesn't matter with the dislikes. Anyway, let's read the comments.
Oh boy, looks like my besties love the video and spreaded the hashtag on YouTube. And wait a second, did Kalu just report it to my mother about what I uploaded? And holy moly, Kalu already called my mom about this. Now I'm in serious trouble right now. Gina, Gina, Gina. Get downstairs now. You have something to explain to me. Coming, mom. Um, what is it, mom? Daughter, I just received a call from Kalo, and he said that you made a video about having him as your boyfriend and shipping the couple with the hashtag pound Kaijina. Is this true? Um, um, well, you got me this time. I did make a video about having Kalo as my boyfriend, and telling everyone in the video to ship the couple with the Kaijina hashtag. And I didn't even realize and know the fact that Kalu doesn't have a girlfriend in his actual show. I'm sorry. Gina. Why would do a video like this? Didn't you realize that Kalo doesn't have a girlfriend in the show? You seriously need to think before you do it, but no. You didn't. I am so disappointed at you daughter. For this, you'll be doing 500 jumping jacks in the backyard. So let's go. Okay, mommy, I am on it. Done. I'm so sick and tired of being locked up in jail all the time. I'm feeling pretty bored, and there's nothing else I can do inside the jail. Oh, and tomorrow is December 25th, which marks the day of Christmas. And the day where all children open their presents. And I'm getting nothing for Christmas, only coal. And I really wish I can impersonate and disguise myself as a Santa and... Hey, what did I just say? Impersonate and disguise myself as a Santa. Oh yeah, what I just said recently, gave me a brilliant idea. I am gonna impersonate and disguise myself as a Santa and trap all children who attempt to want something to Christmas in front of me, and then I'll trap Millie in a cage and bury her alive. <laughs> but before I do that, I need to find a way to get out. I know how. I'm gonna use a goose below in my shoes. So I can escape from jail once again. Three seconds to blast off. Three, two, one. Blast off. Now that I've escaped from jail with my super boost, it's time to disguise myself as a Santa. Man. I can't wait to see Sandra again and ask him what I want for Christmas. Yeah, same here lols. But I wonder where Santa is. He should be here by now. Joe, Joe, Joe. Welcome kids, to my Christmas order station. Sorry if I was late, but to those who want something for Christmas, say it in front of me. This is gonna be so ricky, cause I'm gonna be paid to have all children who attempt to walk for this Christmas. Hey little twins, come closer. What do you girls want for Christmas? I want a new toolbox and a new plunger, and I want a- You'll have what I want, be it or nothing. <coughs> ha 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 ha. Who else wants to beg me for generosity and friendship? Hello, Sam. Would you please bring me- No. Next one. Bad. 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 Very bad. No. Naughty. Very naughty. So it's saying. Alright. Who's next? Go ahead, Harold. Tell Santa what you want for Christmas. I want a new super limit tire with lots of cool superpowers and powers to build anything, and I want a big gun to split Adventure Bay. I like you, Harold. 
I'll see what I can do for you. Looks like I see Millie, and she is walking towards me. And now, it's my chance to trap her. Alright Millie. Tell Santa what you want for Christmas. Tell me Millie. What gifts do you want to get for this Christmas? I want a pink dollhouse. What did I just hear? Did you say booby trap? Pleasure. Ha 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 Oh my gosh, Santa, realize her immediately. No, because she is just a ripoff of Lily and she needs to be buried alive for existing in this planet. So there's no way that you're gonna stop me now. Ha 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 Why Santa is doing this to my daughter? He would never ever kidnap people. Wait. If he is not the real Santa. That must be a fake Santa. And also, I recognize that voice. It's the troublemaker Bob. He just disguised himself as Santa Claus and trapped my daughter Millie. Oh, and also, he tricked many children by trapping them and falling into the sewer. This brat is not getting away with this. I'm so gonna call the police to stop him, and also, I will call Susan, Mary and Johnny to stop him. Hello, police, Johnny, Susan and Mary. Could you all please come over here? Because Bob, the fig Santa trapped my daughter Millie, so I need all of you to stop him from attempting to bury Millie alive. Hey, let me go you fake Santa. I know you are Bob disguised as Santa. No, because you were just created by Kenny Anime, and you were supposed to not exist in this world. I see him. Now do your thing, Susan. Oh shit, I'm clangled up. Let me go, you naughty kids. No, because you trapped lots of children and they're about to drown in the sewer and you trapped nap this poor little girl. Yeah, my brother is right. And also, we will take your hat off to know who are you. Wait. I know who is this guy and I recognize his voice. It was Bob. He just disguised himself as Santa and trapped children into the sewer and kidnapping Millie, my daughter. I knew this troublemaker was going to do something bad. Because of what he has done, he needs to get arrested for this. Alright. Now where's the prisoner who escaped from jail once again? So, Bob. Looks like you committed two big crimes today, trapping children out of the sewer and kidnap Millie and bury her alive. From now on, you are no longer escaping from jail, but this time, permanently, and you will not be able to escape again because our prison is now laser beams. Now get inside the police car right now you cruel maker. And now that Bob is getting arrested once again, can you guys please do me a big favor? Can you help save those kids who got trapped in the sewer? We need to save them before they get drowned even more. Yeah, sure whatever. We're on that. We are to save those poor children from the sewer. You are going to stay in jail until you get old. And don't even think about escape again, because, you know, we added laser beams and cameras everywhere. Now stay in here forever. Dang. This sucks really hard. Now the whole prison is full of laser beams and cameras. And now there's no way that I can escape now. Where's the other for me? Hey guys. It's me once again. And I wanted to say a happy Merry Christmas to all of you. And I hope you all guys stay safe during Christmas. Anyway, this is me. Peace out.